Hi guys, bringing you another video of how to download and install Daisy Zero basically. Um, if you haven't seen anything about this this like mod whatsoever, then you should go fucking do so because it is pretty awesome. Um, I haven't played a mod with this much, this much immersion that it feels like we're actually playing the Daisy mod again for the first time ever. Um, it is really well done by a guy called Optics. Um, and he's made it so it's first person only so people, a lot of people are going to kick off saying hey, I'm a third person don't care um, it's fucking immersive you get in there you're like oh yeah is something f like following me or something it's it's kind of like the mouse but on roids and ten times better it's um it's still in like early alpha and you know he's got a lot of work to you know put like extra stuff in there but at the moment you know tense work you know it's got everything pretty much in there from the mod um you've got hatchets painkillers this that and you got some extra weapons in there and it's freaking awesome so yeah go down on this mod basically and i'll tell you how to basically do that now so what you need to do is you need to come onto the World of Roleplay, basically, website. It's up here. I'll leave it in the description so you can just click on it, you know, as they do. Um, basically, this is what the launch looks like. It is basic as fuck. If you cannot, you know, it's no, not complicated whatsoever. You know, it's really easy, and I'll show you how to do that in a second. But first, you need to download it. So you come to here external download link that is for the launcher so you're going to right click that and it will come up with this you click download it will come down here and you will download it you will install it because that is the simple part so once you've done and downloaded and installed that I need you to come back onto the page and right click the cup terrain core optional you need this to freaking make the um, basically run the mod it's 5.9 gig so if you don't have very good internet I'll see you in a week um, but it's worth it it's it's pretty good the mod runs pretty well with it it's better than all into like all in armor like train pack light or the normal one it's a lot better so get your cup basically download that shit so once uh, after a week you downloaded it you know you need to boot up your uh, your launcher and it's gonna look basically something like this Ooh. and guess what we're gonna do next we're gonna press select and we're going to go down and find our armor free folder which is gonna be in here Very common and you're gonna get armor free once you've highlighted your armor free folder, press OK. That's that done. That's 50% of the work. Now all we're going to do is go, right, I've downloaded the cup train, like, train pack. Click the button. Click select. Go all the way back into the armor free folder. And then find the folder, which is there. Boom. You've done it. Congratulations. It's that easy. Right, and then what we need to do is go verify and launch. It will do all its fancy techno bullshit, whatever it does. Okay, I don't know what the fuck it's doing. It's just scanning through all the files and stuff. Once that's done, it will just boot up and job done. That easy. If it comes out of any errors or something, you've done something wrong. It, it can't be any easier than this. Um, so, if it comes out of any errors or whatever, then your cup version is probably you know corrupted or some shit. So delete it, re-download it, or fix it somehow. Um, I don't think there's anywhere else you can download it except from manually. So literally just download it again. I'll try and fix it somehow. Um, yeah, just leave a comment down below if you have any problems. I'll, I'll do my best to try and fix it. Um, you know, I'm not a technical genius, so I'm, I'm not going to be able to fix anyone. If it's pretty simple, like press this, press that, job done. But if it's anything, um, if it's anything 
really bad, then obviously I'll, I'll sort of, uh, basically, yeah, if there's anything bad and it's like nothing that I can do, just come on here and um, like leave a comment for, uh, for Optics, and because he, he, it's his, his installer, so basically, um, yeah, you should be able to fix it, hopefully. Uh, you know, go on the feedback and ideas or the change log or whatever, just stick and say, oh, my launcher's not working, please help me, help, help, help. And um, hopefully she should get back to you and fix it, because he's the boss man, he's the, you know, the dev of this, of this mod, so, uh, right, should be done. Yeah, see that, it's all done. Launch it, play it, kill people, have fun, job done. You deserve it. Right, thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you in the next video. You know, peace out.